Welcome back everybody, I'm Kiralis and this is City Skylines, so just sit back, relax and enjoy Sound Police whoop whoop and I took the liberty yesterday to kind of do some off-camera work here around the golf course. I spent like four hours just placing bushes, rocks and trees because it's been undone for like forever and I've been seeing comments from you guys like Kiralis is not done yet. Well, now it's kinda done. The only thing which is not really done is the clubhouse, because I kinda forgot to download assets. And uh, my game takes like 20 minutes to load each time. So if I forget to enable something or download an asset, I just don't want to restart because it's gonna be like 20 minutes of doing nothing. But in today's episode, I kinda thought like we're just gonna add some bus lines, train lines, and just kinda purifying this area, because I do... I'm loving it. I know it may be not looking as good as those British suburbs here because the road placements are just beautiful, but we gotta think about the situation, right? This is kinda like closer to the main city, so it's kinda neatly laid out. This is a little bit further away, so I guess the placement of the houses can be really random and the road system can be kinda semi-random. But I, I am loving it, I am loving it. I kinda wanna do some stuff here first. Because uh, I think just today's episode is just going to be purifying this area, like making some, some uh, beautiful parks, adding some bus lines, and just getting some communication into this place. This is such a pretty asset, the Buffalo Grill. I'm loving it, and I kind of think, like, you know what, let's just take this guy. Let's place him here as well, just because it kind of looks awesome. This is what? A police station. You know what? We can move this police station maybe to, to the other side of the road hereabouts. Like this. And the only thing which I'm kind of kind of lacking out here is the traffic. The traffic is super bad here, by the way. Can you just be quiet, by the way? Because, I mean, this, for example. A thing that we could do here is maybe just take this as a one-way road and this here as a one-way road uh, here here and here can you please be quiet holy crap so that means that kind of causes less traffic lights and hopefully the traffic flow is gonna be much nicer here in this neighborhood but I'm loving the layout. Like, I'm loving like, how the houses look. Even though, let me see here. Here are some upgrades going on. And just take a peek at those Stockholm houses. I'm not really fond of the level 4 upgrades, I guess. Like, not this type of house. Maybe we can uh, disable those. Maybe not. Maybe they can just feed the theme. Holy crap, this neighborhood. But this... I need to move away from this. Is there anybody else upgraded with it somewhere else? I think there's a mod to enable the sirens, by the way. But and this, by the way, this is kind of like semi derp. Uh, if you just take how the placement look, because this is kind of like uphill, right? So some of the houses look super derp, but it's kind of still kind of cool because it kind of gives us tons of different elevations and stuff. But uh, I've seen some of them, and they kind of like floating about, which is kind of like meh. Like here, for example, <laughs> look at those back gardens. <laughs> it's pretty steep, I guess. But it still works out. Uh, yeah, let's get, just get back. And the golf course, loving it. If you're using the, the Terraform mod, if are you just planning, this is so awesome. Like the water placement. Before you know how you could use, like, before in season one, we use like water pumps and stuff. Here you have like those placeholders for water, which you can kind of adjust the, the level of, uh, of water in. So just have like four placeholders, and that's not never gonna get dry out. Because if you remember, like season one, we had like a big racetrack with water and had those pumps and it just was overflowing and was just a big mess. Loving it. The traffic here. Don't look at this, by the way. It's really bad. Like here, <laughs> especially here. I mean, zhuzh, 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 zhuzh. so that is something we need to kind of focus on. I think like a temp good solution would be 
just to kind of get rid of some of the traffic here. I love the tracks and everything. I mean, it looks just beautiful, but the traffic is just obnoxious. Like, look at this guy. What are you doing? Have you just parked? No, you just see. I mean, this is just messed up. So I think like a temp solution would maybe be to do this. Can I you do? No, I don't want to do you, but um, I want to kind of... Hmm. Which level? No, that's zoom, zoom. If I do... Don't don't hate me for this, all right? Don't... <laughs> that's a little bit steep, I guess. But uh, this is just a little temp, temp, temp thing. If I do something like this and kind of... Maybe not. Um, hmm. That should. Don't worry. This is going to be so removed. But just to try this out. I guess this will mean that less... Like, this is not perfect. Like, they go up here. <laughs> they go down here. So there's going to be tons of accidents happening here. But we don't really have to roleplay it. Because I think that's going to ease some of the traffic in this roundabout at least as soon as every truck has updated their route they're going to be using this instead and now we just need to kind of figure out that but that's going to be tweaked let's just get back to the main objective holy crap <laughs> look at this are you freaking kidding me we got ourselves a convoy um i guess they're not stopping so i mean it's not a bad thing But it's not a good thing. I mean, the line of trucks is kind of like never ending. But uh, yeah, it is what it is. Here is bad. So that kind of sucks. Those guys are upgrading, so that's perfect. And let's just get back to this. I'm not going to be spending time on traffic in this episode. I've been thinking, we do, do have tons of assets. First of all, we need some bathrooms. And I do have the bathroom asset hereabouts. So let's maybe just put it down here. And that kind of looks pretty decent. This station is elevated, as you guys can see. It's gonna be continuing some about, or this might be just the, the end. And then we're gonna have this here, which kinda go, gonna continue. It would be kinda cool having it going like through the through the golf course somehow. Just just imagine being on a train and being hit by a golf ball. <laughs> that would be kinda cool. Uh, yeah, let's just add a little line to this guy then. Uh, we're gonna add a line from from this guy into this guy. I could do this off camera, but there's gonna be a lot of hate that I kinda, kinda did so much stuff off camera that you guys are gonna be super hateful for that. So let's do this on camera. So this goes back. I'm gonna change the line call to something purdy, like super blue, even dark blue. Maybe like that. It's got an Eronsoons Torg, and I don't really want those because they're like super huge. So let's remove this guy. And let's maybe, this is a five car. BT Flex. This is a one, one way. I don't know if this is the smallest version of it. Maybe we should, let's add one, two, and three. Because this is going to be like, uh-oh, we do have a situation, everybody. Why are you guys dying over here? Like, I know that you, that you die, like a natural cause, I guess, but there's a lot of you in this little neighborhood. What it is, what it is, I guess shit happens, but they're actually using my golf course paths. Look at them. Even like little bicycles things going on here. Oh, this is beautiful. Where are you guys coming from? I'm wondering if there's a, there's a limit for how long people can be traveling by, by foot in the game. Oh, it's, it's, it's absolutely beautiful. So those guys should be using... Yes, there they are. They are a bit small maybe, but... Well, maybe not. I mean, there's a lot of people waiting for the train here. But I think it's since we got free trains going on on this line, we should be able to cope with the demand, I guess. Um, let me see here. Well, there's some people being left out, I guess, but free trains, I take it. Can't have more trains. And also, we have this station here, which is going to be continuing over here. 
Why is this not connected? Let's just connect that as well. Awkward commentary with Kiralas. Uh, is it this one? This this one. So let's go with this into that. There's gonna be a little crossing here, which is gonna be super dirt. But this is kind of like the small suburbs. I don't think there's gonna be a lot of traffic in this region. Maybe it is if we add like tons of buses and whatnot. Here on the far end, what we could do here is just to add. Hmm. <laughs> okay, look at this by the way. Ooh, 85. Well, I'm just gonna show you this. This is such a per pretty like little bus station thing. Ooh, is that like lamps on the inside or something? Yes, it is. Look at them. Look at the Italian flag. Everything is just perfect. This is a really cool asset. I just love the looks of it. But that is something we gotta have in the main city because I mean, this is kind of like pointless having in the suburb. But it's a beautiful little bus stop. We even got a little kiosk, a grill thing over here. So that is something we will use in a later stage, but I was thinking maybe one of those old large bus depots because I haven't used one of those yet. Yes. Is this the big one? What's the price difference? 800 bucks versus 720. I can afford. How much does it cost? 40k. I can afford this. How is this looking? Well, it's a little bit semi semi derp texture, I guess, but it's kind of like an old brick UK -ish bus terminals. No, not bus terminal, bus station, so bus depot. So that means if I just kind of decide to add, and by the way, you need to add one of those as well, some about. This kind of like a little the bus thingy. Huh. I just, like, look, look, look. like, I mean, I'm a little bit aggravated that my game takes like 20 minutes to load. Uh, but I can't live without the mods. I mean, like this game without the mods wouldn't be as fun as it is with the mods. So I need to play with the mods and assets and whatnot. So as thinking, just to connect this as in the best manner, I think we need to interloop those those bus stops here. So if we take a few here, then I think the legit point would be just to place this. Okay, this is kind of like the commercial zone. Let's place one here and just one outside the train station because I think that you know people can jump off the train, take a bus just straight out. And this is gonna be one of the smallest ones. So let's just go here. I know there's not, not really anything here on this side, but it's gonna be in the future, so we can just add well that's not, that's kinda enough. And then just into loop on its own. And then we're gonna change the color to a lime. Kinda ish. And what goes for buses, I'm gonna be using, let me see here, we have the Hotchback. Remove you. And maybe add some Volvos. How many do we need? One, two, four buses, maybe. This is something we can adjust because we can see how many people are going to be waiting at the bus stops uh, in a later stage. But are you coming from this bus depot? Yes, you are. Look at them. There it is. The Volvo. Uh, any more coming up? Yep, here it is. So that should be, oh, this is kind of like one of those harmonica buses. Let me just call them harmonica buses, all right? I know they aren't called harmonica buses, but I'm just going to call them there. So there we go. There's one line at least going out to this place, which means they're going to be super, super happy. Now we just need to kind of think about the situation. So now what I think we're going to do, this is a two-way bus uh, train terminal. So if I place you here, because that was a one-way, which we just changed. So if that goes down to this, goes into that goes into you then this might go all the way around the whole neighborhood I guess I'm not very good with buses everybody so you have to excuse me but I'm, I'm, I'm trying to my best I'm trying my best all right so leave Kerala's alone then we're just gonna go zoom 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 Ooh. zoom 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 uh, zoom and maybe hmm crap it kind of goes into that I don't know what I don't want to have another bus line or bus stop here but I guess we need to have one so let's just have one on this side and then it just goes in completes line so that <laughs> kind of derp looking but it kind of kind of covers the whole the whole area over here uh, where we got the house at least it's gonna be orangey and the buses for this one I do like the Volvos don't hate me everybody but the Volvos are pretty amazing delete line <laughs> I know. Are you kidding me? All right, let's do that again. Boom, zoom, and bam. Truly sorry for that. I kind of pressed the wrong button. 
and what color will this be this is going to be orangey and select types um bus line five holy crap you got a lot of vehicles in in inbound well i guess i can just keep uh, vehicles in queue remove your vehicle the bus here remove you no crap uh, remove how big are those guys? 115 Solaris Urbano. You know what? Like, we can go with them, I guess. I do like the Volvos, but everything kind of works. <laughs> this is such a random bus station here, by the way. There's not a lot of people using them. Uh, uh oh. I think the fire coverage here is absolutely crap, so I think we need to get out. Kind of get some more fire stations in because they're going to get burned down to the ground otherwise. Well, that seems to be working. So let's add the final bus stations uh, or bus lines. So we have one which kind of goes into loops there. Let's add one more. From you. And this one connects to add stop. And then it goes, can I, we can maybe have one which goes within the suburb itself. Because people love stuff like this. Bus lines. And we still need to add the metro, by the way. I'm such a derp. I mean, which episode is this? I don't know, but... We still haven't added, added a, a single metro station in this city. Which is which is kind of bad. It's kind of, kind of, kind of semi bad. I'm, I'm just thinking, you know what I'm doing? I'm causing so much. Select types. And get some Volvos in here. Bam, bam, bam. And bam. That should be enough, right? I'm causing so much extra traffic here because imagine all the buses are going to be coming f this this avenue here. And we already have like a traffic problem over here. So that's that's going to be super bad. At least I'm kind of semi happy because people are actually using it. Look at look at the amount of flow of people about here in this neighborhood. Look at him! This is just beautiful! Should we add another one? Cause, cause we are like super amazing? Question is if we do another one. Uh, if we need another one. We could maybe... You know what, let's do this. This is gonna be like the main, main thing. This train station is gonna be like the main hub for every single line in this neighborhood. So create a new line. And this is gonna be going kind of like in here. In here. But then it goes out and connects to that guy. Because obviously for reasons unknown there, guys. And then it kind of goes around this edge instead. And then just loops back on... I wouldn't say it's own. Well, yeah. Add stop and then back into that complete line. This is going to be the final one, all right? I'm sorry about the buses, but we th this had to be done. There we go. Select types. Uh, remove your vehicle and add some... That's a concept one. Uh, let's add five of, of three, four, five. Five of those. Not really sure how they look. Let me just see here. Because they're going to be pooping out from this guy, right? Okay, they look like that. The yellowish ones. Where are you guys? Uh, what you what you? Oh yeah, we can start over there, I guess. <laughs> it's beautiful. Perfect. So we got so many buses. Now let's see here. Why is nobody building here? Well, Captain Obvious. There's there's not no thingy here. Uh, so let's just grid out this. There should be poop pipes all over the place. I'm not really sure how we're doing on the situation when it comes to power. We're still going pretty, pretty all right. <laughs> the problem is like when night time comes, it's going to be super bad. Maybe we shouldn't overdo it. Maybe we should just keep it like this for now. Here we could add, add one of those maybe just to kind of purify the area. We do have this beautiful park by Shrimp bl Blue. Bl let me just see here. Uh... Shroom Blaze, and it's a freaking amazing park. It's a little playground. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. We're having like <laughs> stuff going on here. We need to get out of the way. There we go. I mean, take a peek at that. How amazing doesn't that look? 
I think I've showed you guys this in the previous episode, but I'm still amazed. Like, I, I don't know. It's still small things in life, I guess. Like, parks like this is just pure love. Bam, 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 and bam. Question is if they got, like, super tiny houses. I don't think they do, but we could connect this with a path, maybe? To this? Just to have a little connection thingy going on. And I think we should do this in like more places. Because I think that's going to be beneficial for us. This is going to be a dirt path though. Mainly because I kind of want to keep that little like gridding zone here intact. There we go. It's just perfect. And we do need a freaking fire station as well. I mean, we have good health coverage, so that's not an issue. Fire <laughs> is not really pretty now, is it? And I, I do love... What I need to grab is one of those suburban rural uh, tra uh, fire stations. Because now I just have like a, a little bit semi-oversized, I would say. They're not bad or anything, but they're just kind of like meh, big. And bigger is maybe not better in every single case. We could, will that cover that area? Let me see here. It should do. So if I just place you here, will you do beautiful? Well, <laughs> it is what it is. It's just up the golf course. I don't think nobody's going to be like, yeah, what are you doing here? And if we add some bushes to it, I think everything is going to be amazing. I just have too many bushes. What is that? That's a big bush. Those are beautiful. Those uh, weeping willows, I think it's called, right? Yeah, weeping willow. Don't want to overdo it with them, though. You know me. I kind of love just placing stuff, random stuff like this. Oh yeah, baby. I mean, take a peek at that. It just transformed. We added some bushes, and now it just looks perfect. <laughs> this looks super dark on distance. Look at the texture. What is wrong with my game? I love those buildings, but it looks really derp on distances. Or on distance. So that should be kind of covered. Let me see here. You guys are upgrading. You guys will be moving in, hopefully, as soon as we get some more... Hmm, that is something we could do, maybe. Let me just see here. We could do a road. Let's do a road here. Uh, this is going to be going to about maybe halfway there. I know what you guys are thinking. Like, Keralas, what the hell is going on? I'm trying to make a bendy road for the bendy people, because otherwise it's going to be a hell breaking loose when the bendy people see they don't have any bendy roads. Not perfect. Well, this is going to be a pain. Why do you not bend in a perfect... Well, you know what we can do? We can do this. There we go. And I think this will be bendy now. Oh, this is perfect. So that goes kind of rounder. I'm not, this, is, this is something I don't think I will keep. I mean, this is just a little arch. Just for the moment. I'm gonna keep that shape. As it kinda kinda bugs me out. It's kinda like not not super perfect and pretty. Can we can we make it more perfect kinda ish? Uh, let me see here. <laughs> that looks even worse. <laughs> I'm going to fix that later on. And we could maybe add another commercial zone over here. So about just to have some extra people coming in here. Because that is kind of like the only thing my people demand at this current stage. It's, it's, it's commercial zones. So if I make something really simple. Just here. And I think we're going to tweak them. And what would be cool, by the way, in this area is to add an Ikea, because this is kind of like the Swedish suburb, right? Kind of ish. Very simple, very derp looking. I'm happy. This goes in here, one way. Nobody's going to be stopping there, and now we can just kind of... Is there any poop pipes in this district? Is There is not. Fix the poop pipes. 
and this is kind of like not a proper Keralysis pipe job. This is kind of like something generic, just to just to get get some pipes in here. But I take it because this area is so big. There's so many roads going different 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 things. It would just be a pain just placing them underneath every single road, and it would kind of cost me quite a bit. And I don't really have that much money. Well, I do, but don't want to waste it on that. Bam. So now that's, those guys are going to be building, and they're not going to be perfect. They're going to be looking something similar to this, which is kind of like a meh. But at least it works out. So we do have the buses. People are moving in. Question is, what are you guys demanding? Like, I mean, you got, like, almost everything. Parks. Are you kidding me? You got a freaking golf course next to your house. And you're like, no, park. <laughs> why, why is my fire coverage so bad? Those poor people. You know what it might be? It might be because we have a lot of stupid people in this region. Um, I mean, they should have good fire coverage here. I could maybe put down one of those. Yeah. Just for now. There we go. So now there's an extra fire station and people are going to be upgrading, I guess. Maybe not. There's a lot of dead people as well, which is kind of like poopy. How are we doing on those guys? The small clinic is just beautiful. I mean, you can squeeze that in wherever you want and it's just perfect. Uh, I was thinking about those burning dead guys, people. Uh, factories. <laughs> factories. <laughs> I'm amazing at this game. Um... Should maybe add a few ones here just for the moment. Just to kind of ease the pain and collect more dead people. Oh, <laughs> happy, happy, happy faces all over the place. Oh, it's beautiful. Holy crap, look at the upgrades. Yeah, I do love those. Those are just a beautiful model. I guess. I. I sound of police. I guess they are not bad looking like those orangey houses. They're just not as modern as, as the other ones, but... But I take it... There's a police problem over here. Uh, what's going on? The crime rate is high. Uh, it's just in this house, right? But we have police inbound. No, we don't. Um, what is this? This is a clinic. This is a... Waharongo uh, Elementary School. And I love that building. So buses are working out. There's a dead person over here. I'm sorry. I'm just kind of talking to myself. Just trying to figure out this area. We have 32,000 people living in the city now. So we are growing. This is the main objective now. <laughs> just to read so we can unlock the airport and stuff. And I need to fix the clubhouse. Because that's kind of annoying me. A lot. But if I do... A train line from this guy. And let's say this is going to be kind of like a little express to the... Well, this is kind of, I wouldn't say this is the main station, but it is what it is for this moment being. So if I do an express guy to this guy, back on this guy, and then just back to this. Complete line, color. And I also need to grab the mod, which kind of auto-changes the colors uh, of, of, of this type of stuff. Of the lines, because it's freaking annoying just kind of like trying to pick a color which you haven't picked it already. Remove vehicle, and we're going to add... This is kind of like a little bit bigger, bigger line, so let's maybe add those. Every single train I have is pretty oversized. Alright, I'm just gonna add those then. One, two, and three. So now that should be operating. Look how perfect that looks. Even though there's kind of like nobody living here in this area. And yeah, I was I was talking about education. Um, it's kind of bad. We do have a lot of elementary schools. Uh, we're kind of on the verge of not having them, but we do have them. And then we have high schools, which is kind of like, oh my god. <laughs> well, there's our problem. Should we add this like little high school, which kind of looks like something from Daisy? No, let's add this one. And where could we add him? Can we squeeze you in here? Since I got the... The anarchy, anarchy mod, road anarchy mod, I could just kind of squeeze it in here, I guess. Let's poop this guy just over here for now. And let's put in one of those high schools. 
because that should mean this is just outside the train station which is a good commuting way we have a lot of bus stops in the area as well so that's kind of perfect and now we should be having like tons of upgrades in progress right happy faces a lot of happy faces here but we're still doing pretty bad on them though i mean oh my god yeah we do have a problem can i but this is gonna be looking really semi derp right because it's on a, on this mountainside yeah that doesn't really look as good as as i thought it would um well we could just add it here temporary just so people do you really need power you kind of do so let's just put a box here hidden away some about uh, there we go nobody sees it well kind of and amazing thing it kind of looks like an aircon as well so that should be it and now how we doing we have a capacity for 3,000, but we still have. <laughs> We're missing 3,000. Holy crap. How much? How big is this guy? He's got a capacity of what? 1,000. All right, so we need three more of those. I don't think I can take it. Oh, yeah, baby. Happy, happy, happy faces. Look at the upgrades. Uh, power? Uh oh power is yeah the problem with those guys over here uh, they don't really operate at night i'm not really playing the game much at night time so i'm not really worried about that but as soon as i go to night time hell breaks loose because then the solar panels are not really doing its thing and we need to remove this as well because now <laughs> this is not a perfect solution <laughs> to our problems how is this working out people are kind of using this uh, we're gonna we're gonna tweak that so don't worry about that and also what we could do is this just to kind of do a little semi-realistic situation of this whole thing is to put sound barriers all over the place here because i'm not sure it's gonna make people happy or happier holy crap yeah this is bad look at the congestions here but i guess it would make him happy in real life scenario because if that kind of uh, minimizes the, the noise pollution it's a good thing it's good for you there we go <laughs> perfect i'm loving it we are gaining people which is just super super amazing and as soon as those everybody here builds up we can start purifying the areas. Why is nobody building here? There's nobody here. This is a perfect area for somebody living. This is a really perfect area. It's a pretty area as well. There's a lot of free space here which is not used. Why haven't I done this? I need to zone this. It's painful, I know. But this is part of the gameplay, so we need to watch it. We can just skip it if you want though, but there we go. And I'm just keeping that because those, those houses just require like a maximum f uh, radius of 3 I think in, in depth, so... Let's get a sack here though. Just having this beautiful house, like a really expensive house, and then you have a bus stop just outside. Doesn't look pretty, pretty whatsoever. But it is what it is, so we just have to deal with it. And for example, this is something which I've been kind of kind of not really paying attention to. As you can see, this, uh, there is a path going here, right? So they can go all the way here and go out to the road here. But they do have a bus stop here. So for people living in this house, they will have to go all the way around instead of just making it really simple. Because this is kind of how the people work in the game. They just take the, the, the closest route, right? Um, can I? I can. There we go. So now they'll be taking this route and going to the bus stop. And stuff like this is good, because this causes less traffic um, congestions. Because then less people will be having to take the, the I'm going to say, the zebra paths. Even though it's kind of like the cross crossings, right, crossings. Can I put a bush here, in the little spot here? No, I can't. It would be looking pretty amazing. I love those trees, by the way. 
They just look super perfect and they cast such a nice shade. I think we're onto something, everybody. Even though we don't have any metro stations, I'm not. I don't think I'm gonna keep you guys longer. And then we need to fix this. I mean, look at this traffic congestions. We need to spend a whole episode just fixing traffic congestions because this is no freaking bueno. And I'm kind of wondering here, right? We have this big queue of things, right? And we do have a path next to that, which is just turn uh, left line, but nobody's using it. So what about, what about if we tweak this road somehow? Uh, bicycle lanes, no. Bushes. Will this do any difference if I take this one here? Will that make any difference? Will people be using this differently? Now people are using that path, which was the bike. Which, well, it kind of doesn't do much, I guess. Look at this asshole just cutting in traffic. Oh, it's a police, alright. Still an asshole, though. Well, that didn't really do much, now did it? Um, <laughs> will this do anything differently? Well, I guess not really. Obviously, there's less traffic at some, some stages. But it doesn't do much different. I'm not really sure what's going on here. People are doing crazy stuff over here. They're just taking like... I, I, I don't know. <laughs> what, what the hell are people doing over here? They're turning in here. Changing lanes, coming out of nowhere. Oh, hmm. well, I'm not sure what's going on. Well, this doesn't help us whatsoever, so we can just go back to those. And, and have them. Like, it, it does help a little bit, because people could be using this right lane just to turn here, but... It doesn't solve the problem anyhow, so it's not, not a point. Yeah, this is the bus situation I was talking about. It's gonna be a big bus congestion. But look how amazing this looks! By the way, how does this look at night? I haven't seen this place at night. Okay, I'm gonna pause the game because I'm not really sure how the power situation is doing. Let me see. Uh, yeah, it's kind of on the verge of being non-existent. But... Pause the game. It kind of looks nice. Uh, let me just go back to daylight. There we go. Yay! Happy faces, happy faces, happy faces. Uh, you should be having power. There we go. Um, and now, bam, pause. Holy crap, it looks nice. I'm not gonna resume, because otherwise we're gonna have bubbles all over the place, but hey. <laughs> it's kinda coming along, alright? It's gonna take some time, but... Uh, I kinda love how this is kinda like orangey, this whole line going all the way around. <laughs> There's a lot of light in here. <laughs> Goodbye, FPS! It was nice knowing you! Let's go back to daylight! There we go. Everybody, I'm truly sorry. You know how it is in my episodes. Usually we spend a lot of time doing absolutely nothing, but I think we are making some progress. Uh-oh. Uh you be There we go. Happy faces, happy faces. We got power. We are almost earning. Let me just see here. They do cost 200 bucks per tick, right? Uh, how much did you those produce? They produce about 16 megawatts output. Then we have this, which we still need to enable. Which produces how much does get this guy produce? Uh, let me see. On he produces four hundred fifty, but it also costs nine thousand six hundred in upkeep. We do afford this guy. That's the thing. We could be using him. The only problem with this guy is that he's got the oil store, right? So we need to purchase oil, or maybe we can produce our own oil, which is gonna cost less problems. But that means we have a surplus, a huge surplus of energy. Which kind of means I could maybe keep this guy uh, turned on and delete some of those guys over here. And I want to delete all of them, I guess. Because this is the problem. Uh, uh -oh. The problem is 
that I should be saying goodbyes for ever, like ages ago. But the problem is, as if we don't get oil into that guy, right? He stops producing power. Oh, oh, zzz. oh no, this is bad. We don't really have a power connection from this guy into those guys, which is really crapalicious. Make a power line, girls, and that's quick. If I maybe just temporarily connect this somehow into that zone, let's see here. Very temporary, guys. Don't 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 go rage about this. There we go. So that means those guys should get power all over the place. There we go. Yeah, if that guy doesn't get any oil, he stops working and then stuff breaks loose. Like those guys, they just work forever because they just they just require the, the wave power. And a little bit of solar panel, I guess. Solar, solar power, you know what I mean. So that's kind of like how it works out. I'm loving it. Hopefully you guys enjoy. I'm not going to really keep you guys longer. A lot of people have been upgrading here. We have 35,000 people living here. So we are making progress. Next episode we need to kind of focus on little commercial zones. Because they are filling up really quickly. And we also need to focus on maybe metros and expanding the industry zone. <laughs> but we need to fix the traffic. God dang it. You fix one thing, something else breaks. Never ending story. Hit the like button if you did enjoy. I'm Kiralis. See you guys in the next episode of City Skylines. I could just be living here in this golf course because I love it. Even though there's dead, dead people over here. Oh, by the way, did we get rid of that dead person over here? No, he's still here. How come nobody's picking up this poor fellow? I mean, just imagine the smells. He's just a pile of, of liquid now. Well, it is not the this. Shit happens. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Kerals. See you guys in the next episode of City Skylines. Thank you and bye bye.